It's an issue on streets across the city of Dallas. It's very serious and it's really significant. Illegal dumping like this and worse. It's brush, it's tires, it's household items. A messy nuisance keeping some neighbors annoyed. So we get them to the pull up there. Basically what we're doing is illegal dump abatement. You've got recycling opportunities here. And cleaning it's keeping the city's nuisance abatement team. You put on his truck or your truck? Busy. All day long, every day. The city of Dallas Code Enforcement Department is working on proactive strategies to address the mess. I can't emphasize enough to the residents how important it is for us to try to be very aggressive uh, as it relates to this type of behavior. Carl Simpson is Dallas's director of code services. He says the department just activated an illegal dumping hotline. Residents calling 214-671-CODE will speak directly to a member of the code enforcement team to file a report, ask questions, or speak about concerns. Hotline is not to circumvent 311, but to give our residents a faster avenue to being able to turn in complaints so that we can turn around the pickup time much quicker than we did maybe in the past. Get the time. And that's not it. All right. Code enforcement is also being proactive with 31 additional officers, adding 60 more surveillance cameras in illegal dumping hotspots and posting new signage and digital messaging boards, hoping to help crack down on dumping. Our strategy is to try to be responsive, be quick, uh, and get the stuff removed uh, as quickly as possible. This team hopes the new illegal dumping hotline will help in knocking out the ongoing neighborhood nuisance. I tell anybody that all the time. And identifying the culprits behind clutter like this. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.